Warm greetings and ekamoguramo. On behalf of the government and people of the Republic of Nauru, we are so honored to be recognized by the Congress for the new urbanism for the planning and design work undertaken by my country as part of the Higher Ground Initiative, also known as HGI. HGI lays out sustainable development priorities for how Nauru can achieve a comprehensive vision for its future. Using the principles of community design and development described in the CNU Charter as a foundation. If we are to remain a sovereign and independent nation state that future generations of Nauruans can call home, we must address these priorities and anchor our planning to them. The social, economic and political vision for HGI addresses three emerging long-term challenges climate change, overcrowding, and economic stagnation. Employing a whole-of-government approach to address the overlapping nature of these challenges, our political leaders and citizens have partnered with Metropology to develop a generational vision for delivering new housing, urban design, environmental restoration, and food security planning across the entirety of our island. Together, we have made great strides over the past year and a half to understand the critical paths forward and identify solutions that are both practical where required and imaginative where needed. This Charter Award is a vital endorsement from CNU that will help us amplify our outreach and secure much needed partners for the work we are undertaking. The rare opportunity afforded by Nauru's unique situation on the world stage will offer compelling solutions to challenges faced by many countries, especially in small island nations across the globe. The social, economic, environmental and political priorities set forth by HGI, illustrated and made actionable by our own ongoing collaboration with Metricology and their team of experts will find a tentative audience at the United Nations, Future Expos and the International Climate Change Conference, COP28, later this year. Nauru's long-term viability and sustainable development requires careful and deliberate planning that grapples with all of our nation's weaknesses and also leverages our many strengths. There is a good path forward if we approach our challenges holistically. To me, that means, first and foremost, trusting in a master plan for a resilient future. Recognition of this by organizations such as the CNU strengthens our resolve. Once again, thank you, do back God, and may God bless you all.